Uh, hi guys. Um, uh, I'm making a server about B permissions 2.7.8, and uh, I already have my craft bucket jar. It's a 1.1 developers, and um, I just renamed this to craft bucket dash 1.1 to make it easier, and I'll show you why in a second. And so we're going to copy the regular. Um, I have Java 7, so I'm just going to copy this. Notepad++, which you should download, especially to edit um, some files. And then you want to save this as run.bat. Make sure you select all types. Um, tutorial. Okay. So now we're going to run our server. Oh, a perfect time to mention this. So I'm going to edit this and see how this name says crabbyr1.1.r1, right? I just changed it to 1.1 because this is how my file is named. It must, it must match, and the run.bat must be in the same folder as the craftbucket.jar. So I'm going to let this finish. Everything finished. Okay, now I have B permissions here, so I'm gonna, just gonna put that in my plugins because this is a B permissions tutorial and run the server, and everything will generate and it, success. And we're gonna stop our server. Then we're, I'm gonna I'm using command book as an example, but I do use command book on my server, and command book needs world edit, so. Just moving that there, and I'm gonna run the server, and then I'm gonna stop. Everything's successful. So now we're gonna go into our B permissions, and we're just gonna set up some small stuff. Um, we're gonna go to the groups.yml first, and it says default, and I'm gonna set my uh, default group as guest. I'm typing groups, then two spaces, and uh, you want to type in your first group, so I'm going to type guest, and then permissions, and then the meta tag, and this, two spaces, and then prefix, and suffix. Okay, so this basically sets up lots of stuff already, and, um, uh, oh yes, priority. Priority is not needed, but you should have it. So, um, I'm going to set the priority as 10 and the prefix as, let's say, noob. Yeah, okay. Um, noob. Now, there are chat colors, which you can search up on Google, uh, and it's on Wikipedia, but I'm not going to mention that, really. But um, So, and then I'm going to create my second group, which is called admin, and then do a tab. Oh, I can't believe I forgot to mention this, but you do... you. Right when you download Notepad++, plus plus plus, plus plus, which you should, click Preferences. Then you want to go to Language Menu, Tab Settings, and make sure Tab Size is 4 and replace by Space. Okay. Then you do Permissions. Um, this is uh, 4 spaces. This is 2. 1, 2. And so I'm just going to set the meta again. And then Prefix. This is two spaces, two spaces after meta. Then prefix, and I want it red, which is a uh, and four. Then admin, then space and single quote. And then the priority should be um, one hundred. So this is basically how to set up your permissions. You have a but there's a bunch of plugins you can use, and well, as I said, um, your plugins have permission as uh, your plugins have permissions, so uh, you basically want to set up everything. Uh, sorry about that cut, but so basically, you just set it up like this. And my example, which is B permissions, I'm going to show you one permission, which is command book dot star. So this will give every command book permission. Now, my prefixes won't show in the game, 
because I don't have a chat plugin. So you want to download hero chat uh, dot jar um, for B permissions because the regular one doesn't work uh, because it has had to be edited by uh, the codename B, which is the creator. And I'm going to just go in game and just show you. Come on, come on. Okay. Um So right now I'm on the regular noob group, right? And as you can see my prefixes show up because I have that. So um, this is a perfect time to show you some commands. Um lots of I'll give a link to the commands. But um so first of all, you got to select your world. So you put world than the world you want. So my regular world I'm in is world. Yeah. So world world. Sorry, my my friend is logging on. He's really anticipated to log on, but I'm making this video on a, a fresh server, so Okay, um, I'm just gonna kick him. Okay, so, so basically, um, you wanna do world war, which I did, and then you do type user, or everything is slashing game before, but you type user, arrows to the knee, which is my name, and then you wanna select the user. And then you wanna do, if you wanna, like, uh, set the group as a user, set the users group and then you use user set group then so all I have is admin and uh, 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 guess right now so I'm sending to admin and then hi and now and then I have the admin tag which I did add and now I can do some uh, command book commands which one of them is item uh, pickaxe right golden diamond pickaxe right and uh, everything works now I'm going to show you an example of user set group um, guest right and so I set the group to guest, and then hi, I am a noob again, and then I do diamond pickaxe, and then it says you don't have permission because the guest group doesn't have permission to use a diamond to I mean to any command book commands. It doesn't even have any commands, first of all. So basically, that's what the permission plugin does. Okay. The next portion of the video is just going to be some explaining some stuff for you. Okay, so let me do some explanation of some stuff. So in the B permissions folder, um, the uh, users and groups right here in the root, those are for, uh, if new worlds are created, then those are the files that the settings will default to. Okay, so if you edit these, they won't work. You have to edit the specific worlds. Okay, so um, the config, it says save type, save true, Track type multi, debug mode false, allow offline mode false, right? Um, allow off my offline mode, I'm not going to tell you what it is. Um, you're going to have to do some poking around for that. <laughs> um, debug mode is uh, checks, uh, like shows you if you have the permission, but you also have to type permissions toggle debug in, the, in a console or in game. And track type, track type. Um, there are three kinds, single, multi, and lump. I use single, and basically, um, I will show you in the, these tracks basically promotes them using the track. So I could do, um, flash promote, um, uh, like me, arrows to the knee, default. And, and if I was in, uh, the default group, which is guest, um, it doesn't say guest because this is just the default setup, but, um, if I was in guest, then I would just go, it would just, with single, Okay, single. It would erase guest. Whoops. It would erase guest and make me mod. But if I using multi, it would it would just add mod, not erase guest. So I'd be guest and moderate. Now lump, which is the last one, would add all of them. And I wouldn't suggest using that unless you have like your uh, tracks made like that. Um, and so the mirrors is the is one of the things I'd like to explain too. Um, mirrors basically. Let's say you had um your world set up but um you want to uh have you don't want to edit anything for world nether so you just do world i mean sorry yeah world um 
then the name, which is World Nether, and World. So then World Nether would be using World's permissions and users. Um, so I'm j I always set it up like that at the moment because I don't use um, any specific stuff. So basically, then the World Nether and World the End would use just World permissions. And there's one thing about parent and child nodes. A parent node is basically a node that like command book dot uh, asterisk, asterisk, um, basically it will just give all the permissions, um, for command book, and you can also do, um, uh, other types, but you will always find those in the plugins guide, and I can't really tell you much about that, but basically it just adds child nodes, which, like, let's say, I'll give an example, like, command book dot give dot star, right, and so, um, give is like uh, just slash I and you can do other users or just yourself and basically if you do command book dot give dot star it would give you give uh, or slash I and give others and if you just give uh, give the permission command book dot give it would only give you would only be able to give yourself stuff not other people so if you add the star at the end with with a dot then it would give you all of those permissions related um, okay, thank you for watching. Um, I'll be happy to answer any of your questions in the comments. And make sure to check out uh, the Be Permissions page, um, the IRC chat, which I will uh, give in the, uh, the description. And make sure to check out all those things. Those are very important. Thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe, uh, comment, and like. Uh, see you guys next time. Um, my friend and I, correct, who, yeah, you saw him before. Um, we are making another video about our current buildings and our city. And uh, I hope you guys check that out. Uh, thank you.